Hello students, welcome to our student support program, Additional Mathematics, for Grade 11. Today you are going to learn how to integrate functions of a form e to the power of ax plus b, and how to integrate functions of a form 1 over x and 1 over ax plus b. So let's begin. First. Let's have a look at the differentiation of functions of the form e to the power of ax plus b. First, the differentiation of e to the power of x with respect to x is equal to e to the power of x. Differentiation of e to the power of ax plus b with respect to x is equal to a times e to the power of ax plus b. Note that a is the differentiation of the power ax plus b. Now let's have a look at integration of functions of the form e to the power of ax plus b. Since integration is the reverse process of differentiation, the rules for integrating exponential functions are as follows. Integration of e to the power of x with respect to x is equal to e to the power of x plus c. Integration of e to the power of ax plus b with respect to x is equal to 1 over a e to the power of ax plus b plus c. Note that here we are dividing by the differentiation of the power ax plus b. Let's apply these rules to some examples. Example 1. Find integration of e to the power of 2x with respect to x. It is equal to e to the power of 2x divided by 2, where 2 is the differentiation of the power 2x, plus c, which is equal to 1 over 2 e to the power of 2x plus c. Example 2. Find integration of e to the power of 3x plus 4 with respect to x. It is equal to e to the power of 3x plus 4 divided by 3, where 3 is the differentiation of the power 3x plus 4, plus c, which is equal to 1 over 3 e to the power of 3x plus 4 plus c. Example 3. Find integration of 1 over e to the power of 4x with respect to x. Before integrating, first we need to rewrite the function as e to the power of negative 4x with respect to x, which is equal to e to the power of negative 4x divided by negative 4 plus c. Simplifying this, we get negative 1 over 4 e to the power of 4x plus c. Example 4. Find integration of e to the power of x into 3 plus e to the power of x with respect to x. First, we are going to expand to get integration of 3e e to the power of x plus e to the power of 2x with respect to x. Here we have used the law of indices where we add same base when we have to multiply. Integrating we get 3e e to the power of x plus e to the power of 2x divided by 2 plus c. Example 5. Find integration of e to the power of 2x plus 5 over e to the power of x with respect to x. 
First, we need to simplify to get integration of e to the power of x plus 5e to the power of negative x with respect to x. Here, we have used the division law of indices where we subtract when we are dividing same base. Integrating this, we get e to the power of x minus 5e to the power of negative x plus c. Simplifying this, we get e to the power of x minus 5 over e to the power of x plus c. Example 6. A curve is such that dy by dx is equal to 4e to the power of 4x plus e to the power of negative x. Given that the curve passes through the point 0, 8, find the equation of the curve. dy by dx is equal to 4e to the power of 4x plus e to the power of negative x. Integrating both sides with respect to x, we get y is equal to integration of 4e to the power of 4x plus e to the power of negative x with respect to x, which is equal to 4e to the power of 4x divided by 4 plus e to the power of negative x divided by negative 1 plus c. Simplifying this, we get e to the power of 4x minus e to the power of negative x plus c, which is equal to e to the power of 4x minus 1 over e to the power of x plus c. Now we are going to substitute the point in the equation to get 8 is equal to e to the power of 4 into 0 minus 1 over e to the power of 0 plus c, which is equal to 8 is equal to 1 minus 1 plus c, where c is equal to 8. Therefore, the equation of curve is equal to y equal to e to the power of 4x minus 1 over e to the power of x plus 8. Now we are going to have a look at differentiation of functions of the form ln x and ln of ax plus b. Differentiation of ln x with respect to x is equal to 1 over x, where x is greater than 0. Differentiation of ln of ax plus b with respect to x is equal to a over ax plus b, where ax plus b is greater than 0. Note that the numerator a is the differentiation of ax plus b. Now let's have a look at integration of functions in the form 1 over x and 1 over ax plus b. Since integration is the reverse process of differentiation, the rules for integrating are Integration of 1 over x with respect to x is equal to ln x plus c, where x is greater than 0. Integration of 1 over ax plus b with respect to x is equal to 1 over a ln of ax plus b plus c. To note that we are dividing by the differentiation of ax plus b. Let's apply these rules to some examples. Example 1. Find integration of 3 over x with respect to x. It is equal to 3 multiplied by ln x plus c. Simplifying this, we get 3 ln x plus c. Example 2. Find integration of minus 2 over 4x plus 1 with respect to x. It is equal to minus 2 multiplied by ln of 4x plus 1 divided by 4, where 4 is the differentiation of 4x plus 1 plus c. Simplifying this, we get negative 1 over 2 ln of 4x plus 1 plus c. 
Example 3. A curve is such that dy by dx is equal to 1 over 2x minus 1, where x is greater than 1 over 2. Given that the curve passes through the point 1, 4, find the equation of the curve. dy by dx is equal to 1 over 2x minus 1. Integrating both sides with respect to x, we get y is equal to integration of 1 over 2x minus 1 with respect to x. Integrating this, we get y is equal to half ln 2x minus 1 plus c. Now we are going to substitute the value of the point 1, 4 in the equation to get 4 is equal to half ln 2 into 1 minus 1 plus c. Simplifying this, we get 4 is equal to 1 over 2 ln 1 plus c, where c is equal to 4. Therefore, the equation of the curve is y is equal to half ln 2x minus 1 plus 4. Example 4. A curve is such that dy by dx is equal to x minus 3 over x, where x is greater than 0. Given that the curve passes through the point E1, find the exact equation of the curve. dy by dx is equal to x minus 3 over x. Integrating both sides with respect to x, we get y is equal to x to the power of 2 over 2, minus 3 ln x plus c. Now we are going to substitute the point e1 in the equation to get 1 is equal to e to the power of 2 over 2 minus 3 ln e plus c, where c is equal to 4 minus e to the power of 2 over 2. Therefore, the equation of curve is y is equal to x to the power of 2 over 2 minus 3 ln x plus 4 minus e to the power of 2 over 2. Now that we have done some examples for you, here are some exercises for you to practice. So students, today you have learned how to integrate functions of a form e to the power of ax plus b and how to integrate functions of a form 1 over x and 1 over ax plus b. I hope you have enjoyed it. See you next time.